welcome to another Animal Jam video. So today I'm going to be doing a story time of when I got hacked in 2016. Even though this is this happened like months ago, I still just decided to do the story time. I'm going to be moving around and stuff like that, so yeah. Anyway, we're going to begin in the end of 2015, like end of November-ish. So my friend and I were talking, and we somehow came across the topic of Animal Jam, and she said that she played, and I said that I played it, and I said that I was a member, and she was, kind of got sad, because she told me that she was a non-member, and I felt really bad, because she was kind of sad, and she said that her parents would never pay for the membership, and so I told her that I would give her my Animal Jam password. I was already a member back then, so I told her that I will give her my animal jam password and she can play as a member but i told her some ground rules she can't add no buddies she can't waste any of my gems or diamonds and she cannot recycle anything and she can't buy anything so she was like okay i got it i will not do anything i let her decorate my dens and change my animal styles and stuff like that and yeah, so after winter break, I was playing Animal Jam, and I had like 250 clothes items, and including my diamond silver long. So kind of, not really back then, but back then, um, it was pretty cool to have a spike. Like, it's pretty cool to have a spike now, but now Animal Jam, like, ads in the diamond shop and you can get them like every two months or so but then like in 2015 they didn't do that that much i guess basically well at least when i was around well i was around the whole year but anyway so they technically didn't really have that so it's pretty cool to have uh, a spike even a diamond spike so yeah I, I felt pretty cool and i was noticing that there were missing items. And I was kind of like a little suspicious, but I was like, it's uh, it's okay. There's probably nothing really bad. I probably just like recycled those items on accident. So kind of just shook it off. But then one day when I had 200 clothes items, I moved down to 100. And then the next day after that to 15, and the next day after that to zero. And my spike was taken as well. And I was so scared. I didn't know what was going on. I didn't want to be hacked. I didn't want to be scammed. I didn't like these things. Like, I was really scared. I didn't want people knowing my password. So I was super duper afraid. And back then, Animal Jam could still allow... They still allowed, like, for example, you had your username and you did a password. And it's really similar. Like... My username was this, and then my password is minus this too, and that was my password. But nobody actually guessed it. I was really surprised. But anyway, um, I changed it, so don't try and hack me, because that's not my password anyway. So anyway, um, my clothes items got lost, and I asked her what was going on. Was she stealing my items? And she said no, but, I don't like the but, but she said but. And then she said, I told my brother your password and at that moment a face of rage just came into me i was so angry like i was angry i was so mad and like then she kind of stopped playing for a little bit and like well, not really, but before that, she kind of stopped playing, and the next time I saw her, that day when she told me that she told her brother, she was a member, and she said, she told, she told me that she told her brother, and I was so angry, and she said that he took all my items, and I was really angry, but I decided to forgive her, because, you know, older brothers can come to you, but... Yeah, so then what happened is I shook it off and stuff like that. And basically, she kept going on my account. 
because I couldn't change my password because back in 2014 when I created my account I didn't have an email so I just used my mom's and my mom didn't make an like she activated my account basically so I could play but she she never what is it called she never actually made a parent dashboard thing so basically i couldn't change my password and i was like oh my gosh i i really wanted to change my password and i was like i can't do this i have to change my passcode so i secretly went on my mom's phone and just activated it and then removed all the stuff but it was nothing bad like i didn't do anything bad i just activated her account and stuff like that so now i could log into her parent dashboard and i could always change my passcode but anyway so yeah that happened and a couple months later i was like noticing i wanted to like get my piano and stuff like that to decorate my den and i noticed it was gone so basically this guy this member guy he buddied me after he hacked me. He deleted a bunch of my pets. He took all my clothes items and recycled them. He recycled half of my animals. He recycled half of my dens and took half of my den items. So basically he took a ton of stuff. And I was so angry. And he buddied me. And basically he was, I asked him, why did you take my spike? Can I have it back? And he's like, I didn't take your spike. So I was so afraid. I was like, oh my gosh, someone actually hacked me. Someone actually hacked me. And I was so afraid. But yeah. Anyway, that was basically my story. Nothing really happened afterward. I changed my passcode. But I'm not moving up so well. As you can see, I only have 49 items. And I had 250, so I'm not that rich. Like, yeah, so I kind of feel sad that I lost a ton of my items. And the girl, I don't remember the guy who hacked me, but this is the girl who is my friend, and she hasn't been on Animal Jam for a long time. So. Yeah, as you can see, she's a non-member, but she got some member items. She didn't get any diamond animals, but that's okay. So yeah, that happened. That's my Animal Jam hacking story of 2016. By the way, all the hacking stuff was in January. And yeah, thanks for watching. Bye!